Today, this video is about how to do Sandy SJW210HA gateway installed with Z-Wave GS add-on connecting with Z-Wave sub-devices. At first, is the overview of the connection mode for the gateway and a sample Z-Wave device. Then enter HA configuration page. You could use the username and password during the registration to log in. Click configuration add-ons backups and supervisor to install the Z-Wave add-on. Click add on store and search Z-Wave GSUI for further installation and wait for about one minute until it's installed successfully. Enable the Show Inside Bar option. Start add-on. Check the add-on is initiated successfully. Click the Z-Wave GS option inside bar. Switch to configuration section and fill in the slash dev slash ttys1 port for z with serial communication and generate the random keys for both S0 and S2 encryption mode, then click save. Next, wait for the z with module adopter to be active. Now the Z-Wave controller is on and you can acquire some basic information regarding this overview section. We can configure the Z-Wave RF region in the UI as well. Next, we can try to pair the sub Z wave devices with the Z wave GSUI add on. We should set the Z wave device in pairing mode and enable the inclusion mode of the gateway. Use the default S0 encryption mode. Now the sample Z-Wave door sensor is paired with our gateway. We can check about the status and all the historical data of our door sensor in the event section. Then we can try to open and close the door sensor for testing. You could see that all the logs are recorded in the event section.
Thanks for your time watching this video.